I'm everywhere, says. I'm not even Muslim, but I've noticed how some, for those not articulate enough to interpret what I meant the first time round, viewers of Russell love to discriminate against Islam, making every chance to associate them and terrorism. However, these are the same people claiming the English government are innocent. Here's some f statistics for you. Muslims are discriminated against at multiple levels, and here's some information on it. Unemployment rates for Muslims are higher than those for people from any other religion, for both men and women. 80% of British Muslims have experienced discrimination. Islamophobic attacks are rising dramatically. Figures for February 2015 show a 211% increase compared to February 14th. One in four young people in Britain distrust Muslims and think the country would be better off without them. Oh, that's not good, is it? 44% said they believe Muslims did not share the same values as the rest of the population, while 28% said they felt Britain would be better off with fewer Muslims. Oh, no. Propaganda works, I guess. Oh, we've really got our work cut out here. Look. The simple truth is this, we have to find ways of bonding together with ordinary people, accepting and loving one another and looking for similarities and ways to make contact, not ways to judge and perjure. There probably will be always some degree of distinction, but it's beautiful that there's cultural distinction. I'm now in a Muslim country, everyone's friendly as hell, having nice chats with people, having a proper laugh, eating nice food. You know, and I think that a lot of the antagonism comes because of an inquisitive attitude from the West, of like, we're going to have these resources, we're going to dominate that area. You know, and, and I think that trickles down, affects you know, domestic Muslim populations, it affects people all around the world, creates tension. We are very sorry uh, what uh, people show. All the things we see in our TV, it's not true about Muslims. We know each other <laughs> and we love each other. Marcella Maraduena. Good news, smiley face. CNN and Fox News will go out of business soon enough if we stop watching. Watching alternative news channels on the internet, like Russell here, are excellent for accomplishing that goal. Thank you, yes, do watch me. I will struggle with the weather. Uh, here in Morocco, it's nice. In England, I've heard it's nice at the moment. Driving, do be careful. Uh, other news, you know it's mostly not true, and it's the agenda of the powerful. Look up stuff yourself and try and remain in love. That's some true news.